Minecraft is hard enough on its own, but when you have no armor and aren't hardcore, is it even possible? Like in any world, you have to start with a wood pick and get that full set of stone tools. I was hungry, so was the blood god, so I fed both our appetites for blood and got some food. With freshly cooked food, I hopped in the nearest cave and faced my first challenge. It was a complete waste of time, there was absolutely nothing in there. So I ran off and found a much better cave. Using my professional skills, I made my way down, taking absolutely no damage. Okay, maybe a little bit. And I got my first bit of iron. I was immediately jumped by this skinny looking dude, so I walled myself in, cooked it up, and made some tools of destruction just to find the guy I had left. He was clearly afraid of my massive skills. With my newfound confidence, I went deeper into the cave and fought a quite a decent group of mobs and another one of those skinny guys. With my new full set of iron tools made, I went back up to the surface and prepped for what I knew would be the worst part. The nether. Not only does it have massive lava oceans, it has pig guys that can two or even one shot you, flying crybabies that shoot fire, and bouncing death. So I made a little base, built my portal, and didn't go in yet, I wasn't planning on dying that easily. To prep, I made a bow and arrow, and set off to find some structures. I found a village and stole everything, burning the armor before I could accidentally put it on. I also found a rune portal that had some very useful items, including a golden apple, and some more armor to burn. Having weapons and food, all I really needed was blocks. With all the items assembled, I lit my portal and entered. I spawned right in my least favorite biome, the Basalt Delta. It's filled with bouncing death, so I built a little fort and then set off. Bridging up cliffs over lava, bridging over pits filled with lava, all while bowing down these idiots. After finding something that wasn't basalt, I killed a pig dude and ran on the corner to find a bastion. Yeah, what kind of look is that? The structure containing the most dangerous nether mob, I run straight into it. After slipping by, I ran into my first real problem. Eventually I ran into a rune portal with some guardians that I sacrificed for the blood god.
which it had another fortress that I didn't see till it was right on top of it, right next to it. I dug straight in under a blaze spawner and set up a little kill room using slabs and trapdoors to get all the blaze rods that I needed. I also burned a helmet I hadn't seen earlier. At this point it was time to run back, and spawning three skinny dudes blocked my way I was kinda worried, so I just booked it. After getting past them, I continued my uneventful trip on my way back, pretty relaxed, minus these, you know, two tiny things. Yeah, I only died almost twice, and without that golden apple, I would have been stuck with the bouncing guys forever. Nobody deserves that. I was so happy to be out of that place that I fed the sheep instead of feeding the blood gods. Rather than go back to the nether to get ender pearls, I traded with the villagers I had found earlier. I chopped down trees and sold sticks. Lots and lots and lots of sticks. Eventually I got the 16 pearls, made the eyes of enders, and found the stronghold after like 30 minutes of looking and bouncing back and forth between two spots. I lost 4 of the 14 eyes before actually finding the place. Finding the portal room wasn't too hard and neither was killing off the silver fish. Now that I knew where the portal was, I sailed home, bought arrows, mined blocks, and crafted till I had what I needed. I returned and placed the final eye. I dug up and the fight began.
Hey there are five people watching this, if any of you actually made it to the end. Uh, I've enjoyed mating, making this. I currently don't have any other videos like this on my channel, although I'd like to do more. So please like, subscribe, whatever. Just let me know to move more, and I will do more. I'm already working on something else, so just let me know.